Oops, I just nearly knocked you over. So, yeah. Tell me why every time I fall in love, it seems to be at the wrong time. Hello, guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new. Today, we are going to be doing my picks for my for what I'm going to be reading for the Tarot Card Readathon. It's hosted by Deja's Book World. There are many different rules <laughs> and prompts. I have them all here. I chose Team Ones and I have a bunch of prompts. So I think that how I'm going to do it is I chose Team Ones. Therefore my prompts are going to be from the ones or the major arcana so I have a list of prompts for each one and I don't know how I'm going to do this I think what I'm going to do to start with is do a spread the way I would do for like a general reading which is shuffle so you shuffle, I'm going to turn these this way, so you shuffle these, I'm going to make sure I give them a good shuffle because I did sort them out into suits so that I can make sure that I only got the ones. Deja did say that you can just do like a, just a one card pull, you don't have to choose the same um, prompts for, the, for, your, ooh, for your suit. You can just shuffle a deck and do it that way, but I thought it might make things a little bit interesting. So, I've only got the Major Arcana in here and my ones. I will do a general spread first, and if I complete the three prompts, then I will do another general spread, or I might do pull and then pick a book and fulfil that prompt that way. So hopefully I will at least get three books read from this. So I'm going to lay down three. I'm gonna have to you're gonna have to trust that I've not cheated. And this is gonna go here. And you're literally gonna be lifted. I'm not gonna break the editing on this so you know that I'm not cheating. And then, gonna turn you around. So, you are now on my desk. So the first is the moon. Second, I'm doing this backwards by the way, is the star. And the tower. So I don't even have any of my own suit. Like, that's fun. So let's just check the prompts to see what these actually mean book wise okay so i now have the prompts and these are all the major arcana so the tower is to read a book about going through a major change oh so that that could i'm reading vengeful this month but I'm also reading Brisinger or Brisinger, so I'm just, this is just based on what I know of the books or the series that there will be people going through mm -hmm. some changes within um, within that. I have also, yeah, there's one person that literally went from one state of being to another in, but that was the end of book one. I'll make it work. I'll make it work. And then the star is read a graphic novel or manga thank you thank you to whoever was guiding me to pull these okay because this is this is what i need and i think i really wanted to get the attack on titan there's three volumes for this but i think what i'm going to do is grab my book for this i'm going to continue with Blue Exorcist. This is volume five and I need to read this before um, I purchase volume six because 
I've just I've purchased them out of order, okay? And if you've watched my previous vlogs, you'll know for why. I just I need to get hold of volume six. So this is the last one I can read until I have to start buying more volumes. Mm. Not good. So this I know I already have a big TBR, but this is gonna work. This is gonna work very, very well. Thank you very much to the start. And then the moon is it a read a book that explores the supernatural or paranormal? I don't think you can double up the prompts for this one either. So, I think what I might do... I'm buddy reading Gods and Monsters with Lindsay this month. So, supernatural beings, witches, monsters. So, I'm going to say that this is... This is, this is, this is, this is a go for me. So, there's only one book that I'm picking up, as it stands at the moment, that is not currently on my TBR. Because what I'm going to do is for this one, which is Tower Up With Tower, read a book, somebody going through a change, I'm going to take a punt and say that Vengeful will complete this prompt. If it doesn't, I do have Aurora, Aurora's End that could potentially work for this. That's also already on my TBR. So I'm really happy with this. These three are going to be my Read for Tarot Readathon. Should I, should I take out the Major Arcana and try and get some ones in there? Should I tempt fate? Give me a second, I'm going to take the Major Arcana out and I'm going to pull two wands. Why not? Let's do this. Back, so we now just have the wands and I'm going to give them a good shuffle because clearly, last time I shuffled them, I didn't shuffle them well enough. We're just going to split them and shuffle them and I think I'm just going to do... Um, I'm just going to do two, two pulls and we're just going to go with, I'm hoping this is not going to screw me over, let's see what, first pull, we have Queen of Wands, let's shuffle again and then I will tell you what the prompts mean and what, what what the prompts are in a second and the next one is the nine of ones so let's head over to El Promptitos and we can see what these mean so the queen of ones read a book with queendom or matriarchy I'm... No, no, no. <gasps> We're there. We're there. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. I've read the wrong one. Read a book with a strong female protagonist. I can find that. I can find that. And that's fine. And then number nine. The nine of ones is read a book with a resilient character. I'm not going to know that until I've read it. So... This was already on my TBR to read anyway. So I'm going to pop this in here. So the Nine of Wands, I'm going to pick Unbound. This is Halt, the boy is Halt, the dragon is Ash. I read a send up last month, give it five stars, one of my favourite reads, recent reading. <laughs> and it is a chunker, but I do also have the audiobook and these two, like this is a blind dragon, so this little dude, I say little dude, he's a huge fucking dragon, is already resilient anyway. Like, he's overcoming major things, major things. And so, I think that this fulfills that one. Could I use Aurora's End? Okay, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna stretch this a little bit. The female characters in here are 
I would say Scarlet is strong, but she's not really a main character, but it's kind of like a group of main characters, if that makes any sense. So I'd say Scarlet, and I think Aurora in this. Although she seems kind of like scatty, I, I would say she is pretty strong. She's having to wield like this power that she doesn't understand. So I'm going to go with this. Okay, these are books I'm already reading. So for any of my friends that watch this and start thinking, you've added to your TBRs, it's already exponentially long. Not that any of you talk like that, but um, yeah, it's fine because the only thing I've added is a little manga, which is this. Everything else is already on my TBR. This one I'm actually starting tomorrow with Lindsay. And this one, and this one, I have an audio, and Vengeful, I have an audio. So we're feeling good, we're feeling fine, we're feeling fucking feeling fresh and fantabulous, okay. So if I get through all of these and I can pick any more, then I will pick some more. I really shouldn't keep my cards inside my books because I need them to pull, um... I need to use them but I will find a way to record what prompts were for what books but for now the prompts will stay inside the book but there we go that is my tarot card readathon at TBR I will leave the host like the creator of the readathon um, and their video linked below and if you are interested in tarot at all or just want to take part in a fun readathon for the month of June then I would suggest taking part in this because who doesn't love a fun way to use your tarot cards and if you don't have a set of tarot cards hit me up and I'll do a reading for you I'll do some polls for you <laughs> um but yeah I'm excited I'm also scared because all of these are chunky but like I said all of them are already on my TBR so it's fine I'm fine everything's fine I'm gonna go now edit this because this was just a random video I decided to do. Adios amigos. As usual, if you like me and you want to see more of me, please like, comment, subscribe, do all that good stuff down below. If you are here and you want to let me know you're here but you don't have anything to say, please leave a black hat. It's very much appreciated. And as always, enjoy what you are reading slash watching. And I will see you all in whatever video comes next. Bye. On how to get home in record time. I'm just a pretty girl with an ugly smirk. Convince yourself that it's one of my quirks again.